What's up? I'm Mike. I'm a musician from Boston, Massachusetts. I'm a saxophonist and a pianist. I also play flute, clarinet, trumpet, and various percussion. I grew up in Brockton, Massachusetts. In high school, I studied saxophone and piano with Jerry Bergazzi. I went on to Berklee College of Music on a performance-based scholarship. After my first year at Berklee, I went on tour in Japan. I performed at the Blue Note and performed at jazz festivals around the country. I've played with Esperanza Spaulding, performed with Terry Lynn Carrington, Jerome Brackeen, Bob Moses, Donald Harrison, and later, Jay Holiday. After Berkeley, I started writing my own music, writing my own songs, and I linked up with Surefire Music Group, nominated for a Grammy, shout out to them. Then started working on my first album, Elevator Music. The album features Louis Bello, Nichelle Mungo, Neil Atendra, Rally, Dave Ostrom, and my mentor, Yasko Kubota. Yasko touches your soul with every note she plays. She's played with Alan Dawson, Smokey Robinson, New Kids on the Block, Mark Wahlberg. She's done things on piano that I've never heard anyone else do. I wanted to call the album Elevator Music to challenge a stereotype that a lot of jazz music has. I want to do something really different and innovative with it. We reached out to uh, Sirius Jones, MTV Hip Hop Fight Club champion. Adding Sirius to the title track really gave it that competitive edge that it needed. Each track has a jazz element to it, but not every track is necessarily jazz, especially for the mainstream. When the mainstream hears this, they're not going to think, oh, that's just jazz. They're going to think of it as, oh, this is R&B, or this is pop, or this is dance. But I haven't really heard it done like this before. It makes them want to go back and keep listening to it. Recently we worked on a Christmas album for Beyonce's dad's label, Music World. The artist was Leandria Johnson. The album debuted in Billboard's Top 10. So working with Shorefire led to me working with their group, the Varsity Girls. The Varsity Girls were a teen pop group from Boston, Mass. They had their music featured on Nickelodeon. They were sponsored by Walmart. They performed for the president. They had a song on the radio called BU. So they were asked to perform BU with the Boston Symphony Orchestra. And I arranged their single for the BSO. I linked up with Jared from Surefire, who was managing them, and discussed what kind of things should go into the arrangement, what he was looking for, and how I could make it come to life. And finally, when the arrangement was ready, they performed it live at Symphony Hall. Hearing my arrangement performed by such a world-renowned orchestra at Symphony Hall on stage like that for the first time was a moment I'll never forget. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned. I got new music coming out, new projects, new collaborations, great things to come. So hit me up on Facebook, Twitter, keep in touch, and look out for that new music. Your way, your love,